old saying is you catch more flies with honey than with vinegar, which is a useful piece of knowledge if you're a fly rancher. Of course, most of the fly ranchers in this town use pimp. Want my hunch, Sam? That's why I'm here. He's clean. Let's call society murder silk stockings. I call them bunker shots. Either way, in this town, they keep us pretty busy. Now, what did you say to the lovely Miss Harner? She went by me on her broomstick, moaning and groaning. What's that? Bug. Looks like it's been here for a while. Battery's dead. I said, well, you and a German expensive voice activator, I think. Painted over with poster paint to match the lamp. Pro job. What do you got? Who's on the Willie Abbott rape case? Uh, Liggett and Singer, I think, but it's in court now. We're about to go. Well, maybe she knew him. Trust me here, I know the breed. Be fine for a moment. Why don't you take five? Why, Sergeant Lorenzo, can I offer you something? Maybe some Coke? The soft drink, I mean. No, I like that. Oh, this is for my new boyfriend, Alex. It's for his birthday. This is the tamest of the three shots. The nudes come next. You need a steady. As I recall, you weren't interested then. Yeah, I was on duty then. I try not to. You just wouldn't come across. I seem to feel now that the moment may have passed. Yeah. Especially with Alex on the scene. You know, what pool is he working at? I'd like to swing by and congratulate him. You may know him. He races yachts. No, I just race taxi cabs, buses, occasional freight trains. See how much fun we can have when you aren't arresting me? Though I have to admit I did enjoy that little diversion with the handcuffs. Well, that's what they give them to us for. And what are you after this afternoon, Sergeant? I sense in you a mischievous spirit. Really? And I thought I had it covered so nicely. You like to shock that crowd you run with. I bet that this portrait will end up on your Christmas card. Stability. Chris was right. Reiniger down on Mission Street had made the bug for Butch. My guess is that Butch had planted it. Let's take my rolls. I hate it when I'm at a fancy party with axle grease on my dress. You wouldn't want to get any old cheese pizza on that nice butt. Well, they collect the men's car keys and throw them in the pool. The girls die for them. You get whosever car keys you end up with. If you agree to play, all matchups are final. Sort of like spin the bottle with chlorine. Oh, nice, darling. Where's Willie Abbott? Oh, Willie doesn't play the key game. He sort of prowls along the edges of the herd and picks off strays. Translate that drunk townies. Some of his friends round them up from burger joints and bowling alleys. Sort of cannon fodder for the boys. There he is, Willie Abbott. This is your boat? Sure enough, fishing boat. Come on. Okay, put it down. You can't be so horny you're gonna kill me because I said no. I said put it down. You're gonna get with that, Willie? Huh? You better take your best shot because I'm not gonna go easy. <laughs>
All right, we're gonna play some games. You like to play games, bitch? Yeah. I've been waiting here for about 20 minutes. Are you Susie? Susie? Miss Harner, I can't tell you how happy I was to find out that you were the prosecutor on this case. And it was really great of you to get us a warrant to search Butch Lonigan's office. But, you know, this could take a while. I don't know. The warrant is just for the front room file area. No, the warrant's supposed to be for this office. Sergeant Lance made out the paperwork. It said she wanted to check the files. That's what the warrant says. I just got the judge to sign it. The intent of the warrant was to search his office. The warrant is for one room, the file room. That's here. No, Chris, listen, just forget it. Perfect. And what makes you think I had anything to do with this dead private detective? Billing invoice in his file. You still owed him $2,000 on services rendered. Maybe we asked Mr. Lonigan to do some work for us. I'm not... I blew it. I didn't platform a right, I shot at him too fast. You know, he's gonna think it over and he's gonna realize I was bluffing. He's a lawyer. We got nothing. <laughs> hey, what the hell didn't you say something in there? Fall on the fumble. You sat there like moss there on a was tree. A bug on his lamp exactly. I was only interested in my handcuffs. Hey, look, we're just gonna have to put Roxanne in the hall. Get the cuffs on him before he comes to. Roxanne's got my cuffs. I know, I know. I got caught up in the moment. Just use your. Oh, come on. <sighs> 